Hoffaday Sports fans, Leo Payumo, your Guam sports guy, back for your Friday PNC Sports First. You know, 2K, 5Ks, they usually happen on Saturday mornings. Well, another one takes place tomorrow morning to kick off Autism Awareness Month. Autism Community Together, better known as ACT, a nonprofit support group for individuals with autism spectrum disorders and their families, is holding their 2K 5K walk wheel run tomorrow morning beginning at 6 a.m. to help kick off Autism Awareness Month. The race begins and ends in front of the Chamorro Village in Haganya on Marine Corps Drive. Refreshments will be available and awards will be given to the top three male and female finishers in eight categories, including a stroller division. ACT's mission is to bring awareness to families and to the community about autism spectrum disorders. The main, the main goal that we're trying to uh, achieve here is just awareness and, and to show our families uh, living with autism every day that the community has just an outpouring of support for them. It's showing support that, uh, of the awareness that there are so many, uh, and it's growing, uh, children on Guam living with autism. And with the community coming out, it, it's more than just a run. It, it's a great show of support um, for what we go through every day. For more information, contact Vicki Cruz at 727-1463. ACT will also be holding their 12th annual Autism Awareness Fair next Saturday, April 6th, from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Aganya Shopping Center. And double I, double AG girls high school soccer. They had games going on last night and PNC Sports was over at the GW High School in Manila where the Okudu Bulldogs were visiting the GW Geckos. Both teams looking for their first win of the season. GW All Island Football, Baseball and Rugby player E. Cali at the game checking it out. A good year for him. That's GW goalie Amanda Nkanko there on your screen with the goalie stop. Game was Scoreless after one half. Here's Okudu in the second half trying on a PK trick attempt, but the ball just goes too high over the goal post. It would be a defensive affair throughout the match. GW's last game against Sanchez ended in a 0-0 draw, and it looked like it would happen again, but it would be Okudu senior Mika Mendiola who would score the game-winning goal and give the Bulldogs their First win of the season. There she is right there. The Bulldogs go to one and one. The Geckos lose their second straight. And a mix of under 15 and under 17 girls. National soccer team players are competing in the Jockey Club Girls International Youth Invitational Football Tournament in Hong Kong. And leading the team are head coach Maggie Phillips, assistant coach Belinda Wilson, Goalie coach Ross Awa and physiotherapist Jessica Angelic Marie de Guzman. Guam lost to Laos yesterday 6-0 and plays Northern Marianas next and then Hong Kong in their final match. And that's going to wrap it up for sports on this TGIF Friday for PNC Sports First. I'm Leo Payumo, your Guam sports guy. Enjoy your weekend and I'll see you back here again on Monday. More PNC news coming right up.